Hey everyone, and welcome to the, um, I don't know what video this is now, but one of the, um, development videos for the IAO Minor script, and in this video we're just going to be seeing the paint and correcting a few of the errors I made in the previous videos. So, for the paint, just know that your script must be implement paint listener and then that you must add a an on repaint method uh, then um, the main uh, methods to create the paint are found in the graphics uh, class and and you can access those methods by using the graphics object uh, which is um, referenced to uh, in this variable so the G object can be used to access the methods of the graphics class. And some of the methods are for example draw image or draw line, draw rect or fill rect or draw string. And those are mainly the ones I used. So set color is used to set the color <laughs> and the new color is just red, green, blue and alpha. Alpha is the transparency of the color. So set color and then between the brackets a new color and then between the brackets the red, green, blue and alpha uh, are used to set the current color of the graphics object and so all the figures and strings drawn with that graphics object will be of that color until you change the color. So then I uh, draw three rectangles with a fill and all of these were black because 000 in red, green, blue is black and then I changed the color into a bit more opaque I believe and I draw <laughs> another rectangle. Finally I changed it to white and draw and I drew, uh, drew the rectangles but without being filled in. Uh, then um, this is my interactive paint here and to and do interactive paint the first thing you need to do is to get the mouse location. Um, so <laughs> um, the class mouse and then get real location is the method used to get the real location of your mouse not the RS spot mouse but the actual uh, cursor you're moving around the screen then I assign that to a point variable called M a point basically is just an X and Y coordinate in the screen so if the X of that point was um, under 495 and over 395 and the Y was over 385 and under 415 I drew some stuff. I first of all set the font to a new font, which was Calibri M12, <laughs> size 12. Then the color to white, and finally drew, drew some strings. Then I changed the color, drew a rectangle, and so on. If the coordinates were different, then I did something else. And finally, if the mouse was not inside that or that, I drew something different. So basically, it will be always drawing this unless the mouse is in certain positions. Finally, I drew the titles of the tabs. Um, so I know you can't really visualize this paint for the moment, but I'll show it to you um, pretty soon. <laughs> then, uh, to make the paint look good and anti-aliased, I used the rendering hints. Um, so I created a rendering hints um, object, which is called uh, RH, and this would have new rendering hints. And then we've got a key and a value. And the key was the text anti-aliasing, and the value was text anti-alias on. So doing this would mean that your text is anti-aliased. And then of course <laughs> you must uh, execute this line, this line here, um, which basically converts your graphics object into a graphics 2D object, and then sets the rendering hints of that. So the anti-aliasing hints to the RH and this uh, turns your text anti-alias on. Uh, I know it's uh, complex to understand but trust me that's the way it goes. And of course this comment here means that I made that with the Enfilates Paint Maker which I'll show you right now. Um, it'll be posted in my forum so you can go check the forum out. The link will be somewhere around here. If this decides to start up, there we go. I'll show you what th this really is. So. Uh, for example, we can fill, uh, draw a rectangle which is filled in, and we can pick a color, for example, black. And then we can draw our rectangle there. And uh, a string in white. 
hello world right there and then we go convert to Java and we just copy and paste <laughs> and then we've got our paint what I did was a bit more complicated um, I drew something like this there were three rectangles and one of them had main, another had stats, another had uh, profit I think something like that and depending on where your mouse was it would draw something or another here <laughs> basically that's what my paint is like so I, I, I like it. <laughs> that was the paint. And then, um, where are you? Here, our subject or equals objects get nearest, and this or um, actually hides the or variable, which is right there. So I'm just going to rename this. Um, where is it? Right there. To uh, for example the or the ors. Mm. There we go. And then this G uh, thread also hides on the variable, so I'll change it to TG for thread G. And that's it. <laughs> so those were some of the errors I found. And I'll just uh, stop this and uh, upload it. <laughs> and, and I'll try and run this so that we, you can see the paint. So if it doesn't work if the the, RS, the script doesn't work yet, um, thank you for watching, and I'll upload this. And if not, um, I'll just run it now. So thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. And now let's see if the RS bot works. <laughs> so first of all, I go and save the script. Then go to the folder and compile it. And there we go. I'll log in. And I'll just try and run the script Varok East. And Ooh, I didn't run the correct script, sorry about that. Yeah. Uh, I'll run this one, right there. So that's the paint I made. Pretty nice paint, don't you think? I do have to correct the fact that the font changes. But apart from that, that's pretty much the things it will show. The updating seems to be working. And apart from that, rest if under uh, zero energy. I don't want rest.
so the, the GUI won't close so we can fix that indeed I forgot oops this pose so that's that of course the painter doesn't work it's showing half of the progress bar and zero percent but you see that the script works overall well I'm approaching the end of the time 11 minutes is the maximum so I have to leave now thanks for watching I'll see you on the next one where we'll try more extensively the script um, remember to subscribe comment and rate and then remember to go to the forum see ya